Brett, that woman tells me the victim was acting kind of strange as she crossed the road right about here. As you can see, it's about 100 feet from the designated crosswalk. If she would have been at the stoplight, of course, no brainer. That would have been the driver's fault. Kimberly Singleton says she and her fiance were southbound near 2nd and Bryant around 830 last night when they saw the victim attempting to cross the road. We see her walking and my fiance starts honking the horn like, what are you doing, lady? Like, what's going on? And she didn't even look at us, didn't flinch, didn't walk faster. She just continued at a very slow pace. Singleton says it didn't appear the woman was coherent. You know, I just thought it was strange that she didn't even acknowledge that we were honking. As she crossed the often busy intersection. All of a sudden we heard like honking, 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 and then tires screech. Police say the victim was hit by a driver who did stop at the scene. The woman was transported to AU Med downtown and critical condition. Not a safe area to cross. Now we're told the woman is in her 40s and police were able to identify her through a library card because she didn't have her purse or a cell phone with her. Live near 2nd and Bryant in Edmond, Katrina Adger, KOCO 5 News.